This lecture will be seeing how to install Python. So Python is available across, you know, various operating systems such as Windows, Mac OS and Linux. So here's the guide for Windows since I'm using a MacBook. So I'll be showing you how to install Python on a MacBook. So here all the process is written how you can install on Windows and you'll be receiving all of these notes as a PDF in the first lecture you could find in its description so you'll be receiving all the notes and you could you know go through all the notes from there and keep it for lifetime and it will be a great cheat sheet for you so let, let us now follow the rules for installing python on mac os so pre-installed python mac os comes with a python 2.x pre-installed but it is recommended to install the latest python that is python something 3.x some 3. Point version so what we have to do we have to download the installer first so we have to visit on this site python.org slash downloads this is the site and download the python 3. Point, the, whichever the latest version is there so we'll go, uh, go to this site here we can find that uh, python 3.12.4 this is the latest one uh, when i am recording so 6 june 2024 is the latest one so i have to download it for you know macbook so what i have to do i just have to download mac os i have to click here in the desktop this will be downloaded and this is being downloaded right now let us go to our desktop so here we can find this python let's open this package uh, we have to click continue here and then continue again license we have to just agree with it now we have to install it now we have to put the password over here and now the installation of the python begins so this is how it works now there are different things uh, i know how to install it but i'll still you know tell you how to so just uh, let us now follow the rules now we have open the downloaded dot uh, pkj file and follow the on screen instructions to install python we have installed it now we have to open the terminal so you we have to open the terminal and we have to write python 3 and you know we have to copy this and we have to write it in the terminal and press enter to verify the installation so what we have to do we have to open terminal so for terminal we have to do a spotlight search here we'll search for terminal and here in terminal we will copy paste this python 3 version and we'll write so python uh, 3 version is are this so this is installed now let us uh, see what are the next so we have verified the installation now you could also uh, do it using homebrew but it's an alternative method you don't need it now let us go and open this python idle application so this is python shell mode and so this is the shell mode now here if i write as we have you know studied i'll show you mm, it's a you know little bit small so here we'll write print and in inverted commas will write hello world and we'll close the inverted commas and then we'll close the bracket also and we'll press enter so hello world is printed so this is the shell mode but if you see here this is the shell mode now if i click here and file and i say new file so this is the script mode so this is the script mode for here this is here i can let i'm just checking for now to print hello world in the next lecture we'll be seeing uh, what is the difference between this uh, script mode and shell mode and so this is untitled right now now we have to save it so we'll save it and we'll save it as uh, let's say test dot py every file that we save of python that should be with an extension of dot py and we'll save it now when it's saved so we'll run it run 
so for running it right run so hello world is printed that is of our file test test dot py so this was the whole process of installing python on your mac os if you have you know if you maybe you are uh, using linux which is uh, rare and uh, so you could use all these rules and for mac os and windows all these rules are written so you could follow this and you could do this now there are some post installation steps also pip is the package installer for python and it usually comes with bundled with python verify its installation with this like we have to copy this and we'll write it over here pip version so did you mean zip pip is not defined right now so we'll go here in terminal so pip is not uh, there as of now we'll install it uh, when we'll need it and you could also you know use vs code for uh, using python so here html is open as of now so for python you just have to go here right python so you just have to install extension for python so you just have to install this if you want to write it on vs code and you could you know use vs code for it also so i'll show you everything where you could uh, you know use python and do things so python here is installed python debugger is also there so you could also use vs code and you could also use uh, you know the python and i can so the purpose of this course is to teach you python and i'll show you you know by real life examples and how python really works and i'll also go through uh, my notes so that you understand this completely so this is how you could do so you could also you know test python installation and this is how you could install python in the next lecture we'll be learning what is the difference between script mode and shell mode like what to use when and what is the basic difference between it so that we'll be learning in the next lecture